Welcome to the first episode of Sky Dweller Views. Journey with me throughout Kenya, stopping first at one of their top destinations, Elsa's Kopi. Elsa's Kopi is unique. It's built into the side of Mwango Hill Mountain. The resort is very stylish and has a limited amount of rooms. So each unit is different with various luxury upgrades. The decor made us feel like we were in a massive bi-level treehouse. And our deck was very relaxing and it had a panoramic view of the national park. The infinity pool was my favorite area and it had a gorgeous view of Maru National Park. And it was perfect for downtime in between all of our game drives. The dining experience was official, complimenting Elsa's Kopi's luxury accommodations. The chef came out to present every meal, and we had a surprise bush breakfast one morning that was fantastic. The game drives were remarkable. Riding around in an open air SUV for the first time was definitely intimidating. And it made the experience more immersive. We typically went out on game drives twice a day, once in the morning, then in the afternoon. And Muhammad had an abundance of knowledge. He was proud to share his culture with us. He took us to the Rhino Sanctuary, which is inside the National Park. And it solidified Maru's beauty. I really enjoyed this experience because it felt exclusive and it was absent of other safari companies. Elsa's Kopi provided all of the game drives and their service was impeccable. Muhammad along with their staff made our stay amazing and truly unforgettable. As we wrapped up our time there, we ended our stay with the sundowner. It gave us an opportunity to have a fellowship with the other guests out in the bush while the sun set in the distance. It was one of the most beautiful sunsets I have ever experienced. If you like the content, make sure to like and share. Please subscribe and hit that bell icon for notifications for new content. Hey, explore the world with us. Sky Dweller Views.